Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Demi. If you're new here, my name is Demi. I am your Muslim homegirl. Make sure you subscribe to my channel if you want to be homies with me. If you're already subscribed to my channel, thank you for watching another video. By the title of this video, you know we are doing a Shein haul. You guys loved my hijab haul so much. I got all of those hijabs from Shein. They were only $3. So I just thought that I'd come back and do another haul. This is so unlike me because I really do not shop online. First of all, I just hate shopping point blank period because I could never find things that fit. Like I have a weird body shape. Not weird, but it's just like, I have to try things on before I buy them. So that's why I really don't like buying from online. Like my thighs are huge. It's just, it's just a lot going on. I have about seven different full outfits. Um, I'm trying to like redevelop my style because I kind of like outgrown my old style. So I'm trying to like be more grown woman. I don't know. I did get the full outfit so that you can see the look I was going for. <laughs> Some of this stuff is just like ugly. Like <laughs> I opened the box and I'm just like, why the heck do I buy this? But I'm gonna see if it comes together. We're gonna see if it comes together. Like I said, I have seven different outfits and I have like a couple pieces that just go to nothing. So there's that. And I just wanna say I'm recording this on my iPhone and I don't know how to position my camera so that I get the full body. So there may be some vertical clips in this video just so you can see the entire look I was going for because when you see it all together it might look different than when you just have on pieces okay so that's it that's my little disclaimer let's get into these clothes so this is the first thing that I bought it's a little pants set I got a size large I am a size large but I don't know I feel like this is a little snug like Look at that. I don't know. I mean, the material is kind of stretchy. I like the material. The material is not like sweater material. It's like some type of silky, soft material. So I do like that about that. But I can't like pull it down. Like, I don't know. This new age of stuff, everything is like a crop top. But I definitely have to like pull my pants up a little bit to get the, you know, midriff not showing the pants are okay they fit loose if you can see like i said i will put a full body um shot up just so you can see the full fit but um it's okay i guess i'm not gonna turn it all the way around because i don't want to try to see my sweet cheeks but i think it's okay i'm wearing some sneakers that i bought to match them and these are mostly like for the summer because look i don't know if you see these little holes or not but those are holes and your feet will be cold if you wear these with no socks i don't think i would wear this outside i think i would wear this like just to lounge around the house it's nice but i can't wear this outdoors like it's too like fitting maybe i should have got like an extra large here's me in all my awkwardness like y'all know i can't pose but i just wanted to show you it's stretchy so the material is stretchy so you don't have to worry about that the next thing that we have is this long pearly dress it has pearls all over it has like this elastic you know section over here it has some like elastic sleeves I thought this was really cute, but now that I'm wearing it, it's giving me very much modern grandma. Maybe if I had like a snatched waist, it would look better, but I don't really know. This is not really doing anything for me. Um, it kind of makes me look pregnant. Um, I don't have a stomach on flat flat, so if I suck it in, I don't know. They got the girls looking like they sit in. Um, it's a very comfortable dress. The material is probably like cotton or something because you do have to iron it. Um, it's very flowy. Doesn't like get all tight around my booty area. And I have some really cute shoes to match them. These are the shoes. Ooh, bling. Y'all know I love a good bling. 
and they are like have some quality to them like they don't feel like they're just gonna fall apart these shoes are so beautiful and i thought that they looked perfect with the dress so y'all let me know i have this like belt i didn't get this from shein but i thought it would look cute right here to match the shoes because the shoes do have some bling on them so let's see let's see what we got going on here I mean, it doesn't look bad. I feel like this would be a cute picture taking dress. Excuse the hair, my dang cat. Princess, princess hair is always everywhere. Like, it's like a Dr. Seuss book. This is the dress. I do like it, but I'm not exactly sure where I would wear it to. I don't think I would wear it to the masjid per se, but I might wear it like to run some errands. Maybe a brunch if I get a hot date. Y'all know I'm looking for a husband. I don't know if I mentioned this or not, but your girl is on the market. <laughs> so yeah, let me know what y'all think about this dress. It probably looks best without the belt, especially because I have big boobs. Here I go modeling again. It's funny because I actually like the dress more when I'm like moving around. Like it looks pretty if I'm like twirling around in it. But if it's just like regular standing, I'm just like, eh, I don't know. What y'all think? Y'all see the shoes popping out? It'll probably look cute if I wear some stockings or like some knee highs with it too. Okay, so I don't know what's going on with this shirt, but um, it's a weird material. This material is like stretchy, but then not stretchy. And then it's like cut in a weird shape it is a large supposed to be able to you know tie it or whatever but i just feel like it look it's 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 i don't know i don't know what it's giving but it's not even giving what y'all said it was supposed to give no i wasted my money the color is beautiful the color is nice and vibrant this yellow look good on my skin tone mm -hmm. it look good with brown I like how it's asymmetrical and it covers my behind, but me and sis, we don't, we don't, we don't do what we supposed to be doing. The pants, however, the pants are great. They're high waisted, so they're all the way up here above my navel and they're straight leg. You can't see my legs right now, but they're straight leg. Let me try to put the camera down. The pants are straight leg, as you can see. They're spandexy, so they like form to your body. If you want these pants because they'll give you a great booty, they will definitely do that. Like I said, I'm not gonna show you my behind, but these pants, oh, I'm gonna rule the world in these pants. And any kind of food bush stomach action you got going on, these pants are gonna suck that right up, okay? Now to the shoes, honey. These shoes right here, they are so pretty. Look at the color. Like this is nude for black women, okay? Like this color is amazing. I love this color. So this, this, oh honey, yes. They fit wonderful and these fit amazing. They feel amazing. They don't feel cheap. She might be the plug to buy shoes, okay? So here I am really trying to figure out like what the heck is going on with this whole belt situation because I just don't understand why it doesn't look like the picture like there's like little loops on the side that's what I'm showing you the loops where the belt goes and I just feel like this shirt might look better with just without the belt I mean but it's like cut weird like it's like rectangle boxy shaped but i think i really like it without the belt even though it's still kind of trash it just looks better without the belt i'm gonna say that i love this green pantsuit i always wanted a pantsuit because it makes me feel powerful i know sometimes they're called like power suits and this is definitely a power suit it's such a pretty color the material is good i forgot to buy a top to match this so i just put on the top that i had earlier in the video i don't like the belt i feel like the belt cheapens it um but everything else is good so the blazer comes and covers your butt 
so you don't have to be distracting everybody in the office with your big butt. I need Camilla Harris to put on a pantsuit, a green pantsuit, because this is definitely like vice president vibes. I love it. Let me just show y'all without the belt, because this belt is not doing it for me. And it does have belt loops, so... I don't know. I don't know if I would wear it without the belt, but the, the, the belt definitely loosens, cheapens it for me. It does have like a little clasp right here. Okay, there it is. It has this little clasp right here. Just one, you know, classy. You don't want to show all your goods at one time. The pants are definitely spandex, so they hold all your business together. And I have on the same shoes from the last outfit so it definitely matches well um i really 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 like it uh the sleeves are a quarter looks pretty cute which i think i like it i'm gonna be a lawyer now i'm going to law school i'm not dropping out of college yet it's my power suit I don't know if Michelle Obama wore a green suit, but she should have. But that's okay because I'm doing it. Baby, you can't tell me nothing. And these shoes, these shoes are really the nude. Like, this is black girl magic right here. This is the color nude for black girls. These shoes go with like everything. I have one more outfit left with these shoes, but I'm like super awkward, so. Hope y'all not <laughs> expecting no poses out of me. <laughs> Let's see if I just leave it open. That looks good. That looks really good. Like this is a nice spring suit because it's not that thick. Like it's pretty thin, but it's definitely a good choice. I like it. <laughs> so I am in love with this top. I love this color. Burnt orange, mustard yellow, or whatever color yellow that uh, shirt was that I had on, and then that ugly shirt. These colors are like nudes for black women, okay? I love the puffy sleeves to this shirt. Like this shirt is so comfy, it's not thin. It has some like, look at the thickness to it. It's like a really good shirt. And it has like, the collar is like that. And this color is everything. Now for the pants, the pants are good. I really like the pants. They're like suspenders in a way. The only thing that I would say about these pants is that, um, so they are made from spandex, like I just said, but they have these two like strings. I don't know where these strings go. Like maybe I'll put the model up here so I can see, but they don't have any like buttons on them or anything. So I don't know if I'm just supposed to like tie it to the front. I really don't like things that tie like that. So I'll probably just like tuck it in. And another thing I kind of, not worries me, but I just wish was different. It's like to button this, like the, suspend, the suspender part, it's on the back. Like the button should be on the front. Like this has like button holes and you pick which button you want to put in the back. I just feel like it would look better or it would be more easier to access it if it was in the front. Over this, I got in a large and I absolutely love it. Like this color, brown skin women, black women, this is the color for you. You, you, you. I look so cute. This is very, very, very cute. Like my poses, I'm not sure what to do with these two strings though, but Otherwise, this is really cute. Mm. Y'all see the shoes doing what the shoes do, right? This is what these shoes do. They blend, they match with everything. Okay, so don't kill me. I know this shirt is a little busy. Let me get close so y'all can see. This shirt is a little busy. Um, it does stretches because when I first put it on, I was like skeptical, like this is a large, this ain't gonna fit me, but it does fit and it's a really nice material. I gotta check to see what this material is because the material is really nice and it is a button up and it has a color. Um, it fits really nice and it's super soft. I like that about it. 
Now let's get into these jeans, honey. These jeans, these jeans. I can't even turn around because these jeans are like hugging me and look amazing. Listen, modesty is policy. I ain't gonna be showing y'all my booty. But um, these jeans fit amazing. And if you really know me, like really know me, you know I hate jeans. I do not wear jeans. I probably wear jeans like maybe once or twice a year. And it's like, it's really hard for me to find jeans. Cause like I said, my legs are super big. They don't look big here, but they are big, okay? So these jeans, they're like stretchy and they have a zipper right here so you can get your business in it. They are amazing. I love these jeans. And I'm wearing a large and I'm probably like a normal size pair of pants. I'm probably between like a 12, 13. I don't think I'm a 14, but I do have big legs. And they are, they are flare pants. I'm wearing a heel with them just because they are super long and they're super flary. Um, if you've been on my channel for a while, you know I've been roller skating and I think that these jeans would be great for roller skating. But let's just say this outfit is 10 out of 10. I'm a very colorful person. I love pink, as you know, this scarf is from Shein and it is $3. Like, I can't help it that I'm thick. Like, I am a thick woman. This is why I have to mostly wear abayas and whatnot because shorty is thick. But these are the pants. They are super long. Look how I'm wearing heels. I'm wearing a booty. Like, I'm wearing heels. And you still cannot see my shoes. And I think I'm about 5'4", 5'4 and a half, 5'5", five, five maybe. And the heel, like, I didn't even zip my boot up. But this is the boot that I'm wearing. And it's still pretty long. These boots are not from Shea, if I mentioned. They are from Shoe Dazzle. So if you want these pink boots, you gotta go to shoe dazzle. But these pants are everything. I like this outfit. I like this outfit. This would be like a cute, chill outfit. I told y'all I was giving y'all full looks, but um, I cannot style a skirt for the life of me. Uh, I don't know, what y'all think about this outfit? I brought the telly out. I was going for a monochromatic look. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But the sweater is from Shein and it fits amazing. I'm really surprised about the quality of this stuff at Shein. For it to be so cheap and to be this quality, like it's amazing to me. I was really expecting like a bunch of cheap feeling stuff, but the sweater is good. The skirt is okay, I guess. I just don't know how to style it. So I was going for this monochromatic look this is probably where i lost y'all at i don't know how to style a skirt like i need tips on how to style a long skirt because i just don't know how to or what if i got rid of the pink boots all together and put on white boots <laughs> i love booties like i have so many different colors of booties like what y'all think about this White booties, just can't seem to put it together. Okay, so these boots are like nude. Please don't pay attention to the glitter that's on the, um, I wore these boots one time and I scuffed the freaking toe. So I've been like trying to find ways to like hide that scuff mark. But I think this blends a little better. Like if I was going for like a monochromatic look, this is kind of cute. I like this. I do like it because, you know, the buttons are goldish on the skirt. If y'all can see it. And then the heel is like goldish. But it's also kind of giving me like omnish. Like the skirt is kind of giving me omnish. The last thing about myself is this hella cool jacket. Everything else is not from Shein, just the jacket. And I thought it was really cute. It's two-toned, so you got some red on this side and some black on this side. It's giving me Joker vibes. I don't know. I thought it was the cutest little jacket. Um, I wish it had pockets right here, but it has no pockets. This is like one of the outfits I was, you know, considering wearing it with. 
I told you guys I would show you everything in full outfit. So I was thinking about this. The reds don't quite match up for me. So I don't know. I don't know. The reds don't quite match up. I just ate. That's why I'm looking like super bloated right now. But I was thinking about this. And I was also thinking about this, like primarily black. But I see that the reds don't quite match. I don't know if I would still like try to wear it, but I don't know. What y'all think? Can I get away with wearing this with the red shoes? It just look a little too bright. It looks a little too bright. But the jacket is, like I said, definitely good quality. Um, it's like denim. It's like denim. It's like a regular jacket. I don't know why I was expecting all this stuff to be poor quality. There's not a single item that I bought that was bad quality, trash quality, that I absolutely need to return. Last but not least, I got this super cute little harness leash thing for Princess. Um, so we can go for walks and whatnot. She is definitely not an outside cat, so... I don't know how she's going to respond to this, but let's see. Let's try to put it on her. <laughs> I have Princess on a leash, and she do not want to walk. Come on. Get up. Princess, get up. We going for a walk. Look. She's not trying to get up. Thank you so much for watching this video. I know it was a long one, but I had so much to show you guys. Hopefully you enjoyed the looks. Let me know which one was your favorite, your least favorite. Um, the only thing that I have to say is that I 100% definitely will be returning that yellow shirt. Um, I don't think that any of the clothes like catfish me or whatever. I think they were like pretty much what they said they would be. The quality was good. The price was good because I'm cheap. I say this every video. I am cheap. And this video is not sponsored. Say it with me now. I am broke. <laughs> so thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Turn on your post notifications. Leave me some comments on your thoughts. Thank you, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.